Good evening. Thank you uh, for putting this on again. Third uh, fourth uh, series of forums for us. And uh, I, I looked at this as uh, the role of the city council in, in the financial aspects and the budget. And I think that what we've done, at least since I've been on, is expanded the role of the city council in terms of um, analyzing the budget. And uh, obviously, to make it simple, all we can do is accept it or, or reduce it. We can't add. But I think what we've done in addition to that is tied, that, tied the new budget. Uh, we went from a budget that was um, alphabetized to a budget now that's performance-based and categorized. And uh, it's tied to the strategic goals that we've um, sat with and approved for the city manager. And I think that's very important. We've also tied it to our five-year capital plan uh, so that we can reinvest in our neighborhoods and our infrastructure, all things that are very important. Um, now, obviously, one of the issues in, this, in the city is the fact that out of our budget, probably 90 to 93% is not discretionary. So expendable, I think, of discretionary. Where can we make cuts? Well, we have to fund the schools. We have to fully fund them, or we should. Uh, we don't want to cut police and fire. And uh, we have our fixed costs, utilities, uh, debt service, and, uh, and other fixed costs. That leaves about 7 to 8 9%. Uh, and with that comes services for all you folks, for all of us. This is how we provide services. So uh, we have made a, a number of cuts, consolidation um, through attrition. We've lost about 100 uh, employees. Uh, I think we have to continue to increase our tax base. People talk about tax revenue going up or our tax levy. Some of that, quite a bit of it, is new growth. So I think we have to continue to work on that. We can always thank you, thank you all again. <coughs> Excuse me, it's a great turnout and it's exciting for us to uh, see the interest out there. Um, you know, we've, taxes have gone up and obviously you're, you're residents and you know that you get a tax bill. But I think we need to keep in mind that we've lost approximately $15 million a year in state aid and we're on pace now for our health insurance increase to outpace our 2.5% uh, uh, levy increase. So we're faced with some very difficult decisions here. And we've made some, we've made significant cuts, consolidated departments, um, reduced the workforce by, uh, by 100 through attrition. Uh, we've increased our bond rating, allowed us to refinance some of our debt and save money. Uh, we've purchased street lights. We've been innovative in uh, energy improvements with the Amoresco contract. It's gonna pay for itself, $21 million in improvements. Wastewater revenue stream, selling what we get rid of, and, uh, you know, and a number of other things. And tying our budget to the future, uh, so our future budgets, how does our money get spent, the discretionary? By performance. See where the money is bringing the best return. That, that's all the way across from departments. Thank you.